Hey everyone and welcome back to another Jazzy Wicks candle review. Today I'm reviewing another Yankee Candle home inspiration. You may have seen my review recently of the um, Plumberry Crumble. I've tried a couple of home inspiration Yankees in the past and I wasn't impressed. But I was bought the home inspiration Plumberry Crumble for my birthday and I really, really loved it. I will put a link down to the review for that below. Um, it was the first home inspiration one that I really enjoyed and... For many of you that like Yankee Candle, you'll know that Home Inspiration are the, the cheaper brand of Yankee Candle here in the UK. Um, the large jars retail for about £14. And I know that if you want this spiced pineapple cake that I've got here, which I'm reviewing, um, it's for £14 in Sainsbury's or on Argos that I can see at the moment. But places like Tesco's normally sell them too. But yeah, just £14 for the large jar, which I'll put a picture of now. So the approximate burn time of these are 125 hours. So a slight less burn time than the normal Yankee Candle large jars. And really they're just a bit cheaper because they're not supposed to have as many oils and they are just a cheaper brand, but it's still Yankee Candle. And after having Plumberry Crumble, I was really interested in trying another one. So I got this Crumble pot off of Wax Addicts. Um, I'll link them down below as well, just in case you do want to try it. So this is a 22 gram pot. Um, and it costs £1.34. This is a new 2020 Yankee Candle Home Inspiration scent. So it is available right now. It hasn't been out long at all. So it says on here that the notes for this are, you've got a fresh piece of ginger spiced cake baked with syrupy sweet pineapple and cinnamon aromas. And I don't know what's going on here because if you watched my review on Sunday for Saltwater Taffy, this is now the second Yankee Candle in a row that I'm absolutely over the moon with. Really, really impressed. Um, Saltwater Taffy, obviously, that was an old pour if you go back and watch that one. So I was thinking just because that was an older pour, it might have been better. But this, for a home inspiration, this was even better than Plumberry Crumble. So this is now really reviving my my trust in the cheaper home inspiration sets i really really enjoyed this it was it was very sweet it was cinnamony it was cakey um you got a slight hint of pineapple bringing that sweetness through um it wasn't really cinnamony so if if you only like a tiny bit of cinnamon running through the notes then you'd like this but yeah i i sort of got the vanilla -y, pineapple -y, um cakey scent from it with the undertone of cinnamon absolutely loved it i think if you buy the large jar of this and burn it under your lamp it is gonna blow you away it was absolutely amazing just burning it in my scentsy warmer and again i know people say the electric warmers to tea light warmers are different so just for reference i did burn this in a scentsy warmer which is electric and i absolutely loved it i'm gonna give it a throw rating of eight out of ten which is Again, saltwater taffy, I gave that a 9 or a 10. So this is really, really high up there. Um, that's a couple of Yankee candles now I've had that have been really, really good. So maybe they're doing something right again. But I won't, I won't speak too soon because obviously they're always bringing out new ones. And I've got quite a few new ones um, coming up to review for you soon as well. But yeah, absolutely loved this. If you like vanilla, if you like um, a very subtle pineapple-y sort of cinnamony scent cakey it was absolutely lovely i burnt it for two evenings and it was still throwing really strong the only reason i took it out in the end was just because i needed to review something else but i definitely could have got another night or two out of it it was absolutely lovely so yeah another one that i highly recommend and the large jar is only 14 pound like i say so i'd be interested in knowing if anyone buys it and puts it under their lamp how much it throws but yeah, definitely let me know if you've had this or if there's any other home inspiration ones that you've had that you think I should try. Um, I think the only other one that I did ever try was the, um, I think it was a peppermint one and it was like in a grey jar. And I got that from Tesco's and I was not impressed, which put me off straight away. But the Plumberry Crumble and now Spiced Pineapple Cake have, have really put my trust in them again. So who knows? I might get some more to review. But yeah, let me know down below what you think if you've had them and I look forward to getting some new reviews out for you soon.